Hi everyone, welcome back to Plum Mashable. So it's Planners Anonymous Day. I have Barista Brunch right in front of me. So let's jump in. I'm gonna make one thing really clear before we start, because I think it's important. I don't drink coffee. Don't particularly like coffee. I love hot chocolates. I like going and getting just warm frothy milk, but I'm not a coffee person. I wanted to make that clear beforehand because if this is as nice as I think it's going to be, it's going to override the fact that I don't actually like coffee. So just keep all that in mind as we go through this box. Oh, I do love the smell of coffee. I'll let, I'll, I'll put that one in there. Ooh. So yes, going to cafes for me is not the most interesting thing in the world because I end up with just like hot chocolates or iced chocolates or caramel whip things. All right, so we're gonna start with the standard kit. Oh, wow. I'm actually really excited about this though. I've, it takes, it. there is not, there has not yet been a Planners Anonymous kit that I haven't loved. So I think Sammy's trying to challenge it and see if she can find one I don't like because it's got pink and coffee. <laughs> uh, I don't think it'll work, Sammy. Oh, stuck. All right, so we'll start with the pen, which is this absolutely stunning rose gold. So it's all rose gold and then it's got the pink, the very pale brown, and then the sort of clear crystals in there. That is beautiful. That is so pretty. Love that. So, so nice. And then our special gift for the month. So this is sort of um, following along from Whale Song where we did this cute little pin. We did, Sammy did, this cute little pin. This is a uh, another little pin that says Be Brutiful. Brutiful, very cool. Uh, so it's got like the the latte decoration on the top with the words and then the cute little daisy and it is magnetic. So it'll stick to your clothes, it'll stick through your planner. Actually, it sits in, in my Whale Song planner really, really well. Just sort of stick it up behind. Um, similar to this, I'll show you just very quickly. So it can just sort of stick through there and that way it sits flat. Like there's no pin to that, it's just a flat one. So very cool like that. Love that. I'm supposed to start with the die cut, aren't I? Whoops, I forgot. So we have a planner boy. So after we had a little planner boy last month, we've got a big planner boy this month. So it says, order up. Can you smell that? Breakfast is a thing of the past and brunch with the perfectly brewed coffee is the best way to start the day. Eggs, bacon, croissants, avocado, a salad, the choices are endless. So what will it be? One shot or two. Catch you Mark later, Marco. We're so excited to feature our first official planner guy, something we've wanted to do for a little while now and are so happy that you all love him as much as we do. Be prepared for more guys to make their ways into our boxes and into your heart. Love the planners and the team. He's very cute. I do like him. I like the colours of this kit. I'll say that. Like I know there's pink, but I like the browns. It's, it feels very creamy to me. So I'll jump into the quote cards. So again, we've got some browns in here. I can see them already. So we've got the brown daisy, well, not the brown, the brown on the background and we've got the daisies and the coffee cups at the front. And then our quotes, we have drinker of coffee, planner of things. Life happens, brunch helps. That's cool. Coffee believes in you. My coffee needs a coffee. On Sundays we do brunch. Work hard, brunch harder. So I like that there's a nice sort of combination of coffee and brunch there. It means that there's actually ones here that I can use. I will admit I do use coffee sayings because the sentiment is correct the whole I need a coffee or drinker of coffee planner of things just when I think about it I just do drinker of Pepsi Max planner of things because that's my caffeine hit all right we'll go with the stamps Ooh, that's hold on I need to see if that comes out or if that's in there so we've got all of the beautiful stamps we've got Marco there we've got the flowers and bits and pieces we've got some coffee mugs and what I'm interested in so that's attached, right? So you've got a, a little bar there that, not a bar, a little box there that says, I don't need an inspirational quote, I need a coffee. And that is oh, it's stuck in there. This one though isn't. So you've got the, the coffee ring and then you've got the daisy that's actually separate. So that's cool. That was what I was checking. There's also this cute little, and this is gonna feature a couple of times in here, I think, um, cute little clipboard with the coffee bean on it. Oh, they're very cool. Time for coffee. And they've got some little coffee beans as well. You've got some little um, icons here. This would be really cool. Sorry, I'm distracted by the pro-caffeinating. 
Um, you got some little icons here. So if you are someone that has their own coffee machine at home and maybe you buy beans, that might be a good one to sort of use as your little reminder buy beans kind of thing. Um, there's also like a clean, you could use this one for cleaning your coffee maker, buy milk, stuff like that. So we've got our die cuts and our art card. So we'll start with the art card. So drinker of coffee, planner of things with the beautiful coffee and the daisies at the top. We've also got the croissants and cupcakes and bits and pieces over on the side. And I love that that's a, that's a planner. That really is a planner. That's so cool. Oh, I think a little, little pen there as well. Oh, it's adorable. And we've got, so we've got Marco there. Just put the pocket over to the side for now. We've got our coffee bean, coffee cup full of beans. We've got a little hot chocolate. I'm going to call that a hot chocolate. It could be a latte. It could be a... A macchiato or something else but I'm gonna call it a hot chocolate we've got some beans we've got a coffee bag we've got some more beans we've got a little cheese platter <laughs> we've got a nice little chalkboard we've got I don't need inspirational quote but I need coffee we've got the daisies we've got the croissant we've got the tea mugs or teacups on the other side and then the travelers coffee mug which again yes it is we all think of it as a coffee mug but I can think of that as a hot chocolate mug that's fine that's fine uh, we also have the little pocket as well. I love that it's got the little clipboard there with the specials on the front. That is perforated for you so you can just fold it over and it makes the perfect pocket. So I'm just going to grab in my plain piece of white paper so I can show you the washi. So I still love, even though I don't like coffee, and I know I keep saying it but I'm going to keep saying it. Um, there's a coffee one, I think it was from Treat Yourself, like right back at the start. I still love that coffee bean one. It is adorable. And this one's just sort of like an upgrade on it because it has the rose gold foiling around the outside of the beans. It is beautiful. Oh, I love that. That is stunning. The foil just adds a little bit. Like if you look at it flat, you actually don't see the foil. It's only when you sort of wiggle it around that you just get these little glimpses. Just a little bit of something, something. It's very pretty. And then we've got the standard size washi which has these gorgeous daisies on it. Again, the browns. I love brown. So you've got the gorgeous daisies there with the coffee mugs and then you've got the foiled coffee bean spots, hearts. They're just cool. I just like that. It's just, a, it's like a, it's like a confetti pop. That's so cool. And then the big washi is this really cute flat lay kind of thing. So kind of like all the different meal options you might have at brunch. So I'm not going to do all of them because otherwise I'll be here forever. Oh, actually, hold on. That is all of them. Hold well on. Whoops. So you've got there, you've got um, like some cake, you've got a coffee, you've got your eggs and bacon, you've got your salad, you've got your BLT, another coffee, some croissants, another toasted sandwich there with some avocado and then like a smoothie and then you've got your daisies as well. They look beautiful on the bottom of a page or maybe down the side, but I think I have an idea with how to use that on the bottom as well, but doing something different. It's also got a little bit of foiling to it. The knives and forks uh, and the little spoons are also foiled on there with that gorgeous rose gold. Oh, so pretty. Then we'll move on to our sticker kit. Sorry, the standard sticker kit, not the extra sticker kit. So we've got four pages in the standard sticky kit. So the first one there, we've got Marco, we've got the coffee beans, we've got a little coffee cup, or teacup even, the little machine, that clipboard, and then you've got a um, blackboard as well. Got some cute bunting along the top there. I love that bunting. You've got your teacup, your planner, and you've got your girls having lunch, brunch, sorry, not lunch, brunch. Got your days of the week, your weekend, and your little foldable planner. I love that one. That is really cool. Very plain, but very cool. And then you've got your little uh, barista brunch there. And then you've also got your sort of more functional one. So you've got your glasses, your coffee cup, more coffee cups. Um, and then you've got your barista brunch, which I'll put in in a second. And you've got your sneak peek for the next one, which is Forest Falls, which I'm so excited about. I've seen sneak peeks and I love it. Okay, so then this is the standard paper pack that comes with it. So this comes with the standard kit. So we have six pieces of paper plus the vellum and the acetate. So 
So I'll start off with just the first one, which is actually really cool. So you've got your sort of all your different kinds of coffee. So you've got your espresso, your mochi, your latte, cappuccino, macchiato, frappe. Yes, for the frappes. Oh yeah. That'd be really cool to cut them out and just sort of sprinkle them around a page. That'd look really, really cool. And then on the back of that one, you've got this gorgeous coffee brown. Or chocolate brown, if you're me. That's chocolate brown. But, oh, I love that. Then we've got that cute kind of more pale brown with the coffee things in front of them and all the daisies. That's so cool. Got coffee beans in there as well. That's so cute. And a more pale brown in the background. See what I mean about the creamy colours? It's just really, really pretty. Very decadent. And then you've got your kind of flat lay. There you've got the waffles, the croissants with the gorgeous flowers in the middle and then the planter there and the bacon and eggs. And then another slightly different shade of brown. So the three browns you've got just to put them all together. That's that beautiful decadent brown palette. I love that. Oh, that is beautiful. Love the browns. Then we've got our vellum, which is the same as that coffee piece. Just grabbing my white bit in so you can sort of have that as a background. So I've got the, got the gorgeous vellum there. I love, I don't know how she does it. I don't know how her vellum always comes up looking so beautiful and deep. It's absolutely stunning. So just to be able to show you what it looks like straight on top of the paper, you can actually line it up. It lines up pretty close. It's not perfect but it's pretty close and I love it. I think it's beautiful. And then we have the absolutely stunning acetate. Oh my God. So it's like a menu. So you've got your bagels, your pancakes, etc., etc., etc. So it's rose gold on this side. Oh my God. Is that not the most stunning thing ever? Chocolate coffee mug. And then on the other side, which is probably not as useful this month, obviously, because you've got the words and everything, which make a big difference. But you have got it in the silver in the background. So if you maybe wanted to use the cheese and you didn't want to use the rose gold, you could flip it and use just the, the silver side instead. Oh, I love that. That is gorgeous. So then we'll jump in while we've got paper and stuff out. We'll jump into the additional paper pack. So this is an extra cost on top of your subscription. But honestly, if you love paper like I do, you just have to add this on top. What it does, first of all, is it gives you two or an extra piece of the vellum and of the acetate. Just relieves some of that paper cutter's guilt, which we all, or well, if you're like me, you definitely get. And then it's got six additional pieces of paper that you don't get in the original kit. Oh yeah. So that is the daisies. Oh my God. I know Sammy likes, loves daisies, but I love daisies. They're beautiful. Then we've got our gorgeous yellow, which is a nice sort of addition with all the browns. It's just an extra sort of color. And you've got the coffee bags, the coffee cups on one side, and you've got the pink piece on the other side, which is again, just adding to that creamy kind of color. And then you've got the black. Oh, this is stunning. You've got the black that matches the acetate. And I just want to see if this sits across the top. It's pretty close. Oh, I love it. I love it. Looks a bit busy to be honest, but that's, oh, I love it. I love it. So cool. I love the blackboard style. And then you've got a kind of, it's like a gray brown. It's like a warm, a warm gray sort of watercolor. Oh, I love that. Ever since she brought in the paper packs, I swear I could not do, I could not get these kits without the paper packs. I just think it's the best edition. So this is the last bit. This is the extra sticky kit that goes along. There are supposed to be 14 sheets in here. I'm pretty sure there are 18 again this month because Sammy has no self-control and God, do we love it. So the first page there, we've got Marco there with some coffee cups with the beans coming out and that pretty bunting. Oh, so pretty. Got our ladies having brunch and we've got some food. Got the napkins and the beautiful teacups. We've got another serving girl there. We've got some... Uh, aprons and then sort of all the coffee bits and pieces so the grinders I think that's to make an iced coffee um, and then some coffee machines we've got the bits for the flat lay so the sort of over the top ones with all the mugs and then the food and then some side shots of all of the different kinds of coffee we've got the gorgeous daisies there that you could sort of make your own little flower we've got some banners some blackboards and then some um, bunting there as well that could be used sideways as a to-do that's really cool We've got all of our quotes, so we've got caffeine powered, 
insert coffee to begin I don't need an inspirational quote I need a coffee these are really cool this is something different so this is sort of um, a bunch of flat lay kind of looks down I think they're the right size to fit in a box so they're like uh, little quarter boxes or half boxes quarter boxes um, but I really like them it's something different it's nice to have a little bit more artwork like to have a little bit more a little bit more decorative that's a little bit more detailed if that makes any sense at all so then we have I think it's just one page of these cute little clipboards with the bunting again but the clipboards with the little daisies they're really good for to-do lists or reminders or bits and pieces as well got our box sheets so we've got two full boxes and then two still four standard boxes I love that sort of outdoor coffee area kind of place we got the girl taking her Instagram shot got the little hobo style note uh, note bits you've got your numbers which are all in the sort of coffee palette colors which are really nice and then we've got our four days of the week ones in the browns the pink and then the yellow as well oh, I love those browns they're gorgeous and then we have our mini so you've got the minis in the same sort of styles as all of the kits so you've got Marco in a mini the little server girl in the mini and then you've got some more to sort of drinking coffee and doing bits and pieces and then you have the more functional one so you've got the little peekaboo minis and I love that he's kind of got mildly gray hair I don't know if you guys can see that or not I just love that I think that's a really cute little detail uh, you've got your birthday ones your workout ones your sleeping ones etc 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 so that is barista brunch honest opinion I wish I drank coffee that's my honest opinion I really wish I did because it is it is that kind of kit that just celebrates coffee so beautifully just makes me want to go and have a coffee I might actually have to make myself a hot chocolate later but that's the thing like yes it is all about coffee yes there are coffee beans I'm not going to argue any of that but if you want to see the other side of it which is that's a hot chocolate mug instead of a coffee mug and you see the brunch side of it it actually is really really cool and I do like the little coffee bean additions I think it's really nice actually so I'm not even mildly disappointed in this kit I can see why I could be, but I'm definitely not. I think it is stunning. I love the artworks and I love the colors. I love the colors. I love all the browns. Brown is such an underappreciated color. I just love it. I think it's beautiful. So that is Barista Brunch. I will be using it very, 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 very soon in my planner. So make sure that you're subscribed so you don't miss that one and you'll follow me on all of my social medias. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and make sure you go and check out Planners Anonymous over on their website if you are interested in subscribing to this kit. You can use my code, it's down below for 10% off your first box. Other than that guys, I hope you have an absolutely fantastic, fantastic rest of your day and I will see you again in my next video. Sending lots of huggles. Bye!